Hey, this is Peter here, and today I'll be demonstrating the Google build of Android Cupcake. Um, so basically what I'll do is I'll have a review about this build, and I'll also compare it to the HTC build of Cupcake, which is another build that I did a video on before. Um, and if you're interested in getting this, uh, the Google build of Cupcake, which I have right now, you can uh, watch Anthony Moreno 24 tutorial on how to get it. Um, and before, well, the tutorial will also say this, make sure you have a rooted phone before you try to do um, this update. Um, because if you don't have a rooted phone, it just won't work. And also, you can, so basically you have to have JF RC33 to get to this build or you can just be running on another unofficial build of Cupcake and you can just switch and update directly um, so yeah I'll have the link for Anthony Moreno 24 video tutorial in the video description so with all that said let's get started um, so one cool feature about this version of Cupcake is that it has auto rotate so if I turn my phone, the uh, the whole image flips automatically. And by the way, you don't have to worry about downloading any apps for this. This is all installed on your phone when you um, run the update. Um, next is probably the main feature of Cupcake in general, which is the virtual keyboard. So if I hit a box that I'm going to type in, the keyboard pops up. Um, and basically it's just like a keyboard but instead you use the screen to type so you just click on the letters and uh, you type and uh, also you can set some settings to turn on vibration or sounds when you press some letter when you press any key but that's up to you um, and also if you've seen before in my other video the HTC build has a has a um, white keyboard this has a black keyboard I think the black one actually looks better um, so that's the keyboard and now I'll talk about the new camcorder I mean the camera so this is the camera um, one sec just have to adjust something alright so uh, this is the camera and uh, the user um, functions are a little bit different so right here in the corner this is actually your photo gallery and if I click on that I can see all my photos um, from here um, also you can click menu to see some basic options and uh, if you're gonna take a photo there's actually three ways you can either click on the photo button on the side of your phone, you can click the trackball in the middle, or you can just click on the camera button on the right corner of the screen. So say I'm going to take a photo, I would just click and a new photo is taken. And then with that photo I can click on it and there's different options such as going back to my gallery sending it as my wallpaper, sharing it with someone, and deleting it. And then I can go back to my camera. Um, so, it's a little bit different from the HTC build of Cupcake. But, I mean, its uses are pretty much the same. And what's actually different is that there's no separate app in this build unlike the HTC build for a camcorder so you can't go to your home menu and look in your applications for a camcorder what you actually have to do is open up your menu button well click on your menu button and on the first button you'll see an option that says switch to video so you click on it and as you can see this changed and basically you're in the video mode so when you take when you hit the camera button um, a video would be taken so let's 
Um, and also, by the way, the menu buttons are pretty much the same. You have the same options. And uh, if I'm going to take a video, I can just click here. And it will start recording. And when I'm done, I just click on the red button. And it takes me to my video, actually. And again, I have the same options as I do with the photos. Um, in fact, I can show you the, how the actual video looks like. So yeah, I mean the quality is pretty good. Um, it's not the best, but um, what makes it really convenient is that you don't need to download a separate app like you did before to watch videos. It's all in one app, take videos and watch them. Um, whether you took them yourself or downloaded them from the web. Um, and one thing that I actually don't like in the Google build about the camera and camcorder is that there's no zoom button right here like the HTC build had. Uh, oops, I was just recording. Yeah, so there's no zoom buttons um, that you would have on the screen. But it's not like the end of the world. Um, at least you get like a camcorder and that's good enough. And now I'd just like to um, mention a couple small things about the Google build of Cupcake. Uh, so if, um, so for example, a cool small feature is that if I add a widget by basically holding on the screen, I can click widget, and I can now add music playlists. Um, so if I click play, the song will just start playing. And uh, I can just go to the next song. And then when I when I actually open up my library, um, well, I I don't know why um, my phone kind of hold on. So I would uh, to open up my library, I would uh, click on the actual icon in the notifications bar, and there I am. I can go to my um, I can see like my songs and stuff there. So that's the mu the music widget. Um, next is uh the browser. The browser actually looks a little bit different. The icons different, and also the inside the browser. Um, the actual web page has a little bit different zooming options. So, for example, um, you can see here that there's like different buttons and also the box that used to be here. Uh, how do I? Yeah, so the box is pretty much the same. The box where you select an area and it zooms into it. So that's the browser. And one thing that I don't like, um, so there's Google Talk, which works, um, as you can see, um, and there's how, so that works, but, uh, normal IM app doesn't work at all, it just closes right away, so if you're, if you like go and aim a lot, this build might not be the best option for you. And also, um, so what I would recommend for this app, um, I mean for this, for the Google build of Cupcake, is to update your radio. When you watch the tutorial that I've provided before, it'll basically talk about this. Um, so I would really rec recommend it because I've heard it improves your reception. Um, so that's pretty much it for the Google build of Cupcake.